On this walk and roll, we'll take a walk on the sour side with Guajo Cuisine. Ooh, uh, wonderful little kind of sour, spicy cuisine. Taste a tomato sauce that's worlds away from pasta. These are the jars that you guys make the fermented uh, tomato sauce in, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I can stuff because I've seen it before. It's the kind of like water rimmed. You yeah, have like the right. ceramic. Yeah. Lift it Just up. Keep the air away. Yeah. Ooh. So the <laughs> tomato is that. What about the white good. part? It's the, uh, like, I don't know, and you know, the natural fermentation stuff and it come out. I, mean, I think it's cool, you can see all the kind of little like air bubbles and stuff yeah. rising out. It's the kind of yeah. food that's like alive and breathing, you know? The source of the sour is a staple sauce made of fermented tomatoes along with a few other fixings. Every family throughout the province will have a jar of this in their kitchen to work with. In these hefty clay urns, the mixture sits for 15 days as good bacteria and microbes do their work to transform it into the sour dimension. When it has finally achieved just the right level of make your mouth water sour, the chef ladles out what he needs and then cooks it up with a dish. Right, mm -hmm. the sauce is in the three bows, tomato, chopped chili and rice, mm -hmm. soup, um, what has been fermented. These are you guys kind of fermented sauces that you yeah. use here. Yep. And what one does this come out to? This is um, this the first tomato. one? Yep. So you the tomato sauce by itself. Mm -hmm. I just like the color of that, just such like a bright popping red too, you know? Yeah. I mean, yep. it looks like kind of like classic, you know, kind of tomato sauce out of the can, you know, so that mm -hmm. which you make kind of pasta or whatever with. Yep. But it's like the texture of it. it has that kind of like fermented, like the different kind of like flow of it, a little more yeah. shiny. Yeah. Yeah, and it's definitely that kind of soury pop to it, you know, mm -hmm. from behind. Learn about an exotic land full of many different ethnic groups. Oh, which group would have made this one? Uh, meow. All that and more on this Walk and Roll.